Martin Iguagu of NedoFitness.com. I'm here at Fitness 360 in Austin, Texas. So what muscles are developed doing the upright row? Now, there's many muscles that are used, but there's also primary muscles. And it depends also on the width and your grip. So the first one I'm going to show you is a wide grip. So when we grab the bar with a wide grip, just outside the shoulders, we're going to pull the bar straight up to the chin and slowly lower it back down. Now, in doing this exercise with this wide grip, we're primarily using all three heads of the shoulder. The shoulder is composed of three heads, the anterior, posterior, and the middle portion. If you want to really develop your shoulders, try including this upright row with the wide grip. Now, with the narrow grip, you primarily use your trapezius muscle. It's that kite-shaped muscle towards the back, kind of right here on the sides, as you see. Now, this muscle is used for shoulder shrugs and retracting your scapula. So with the narrow grip, just inside the shoulders, I'm going to draw my elbows to the sky and bring the bar up towards my chin, and I'm slowly going to lower it down. Up again, and slowly lower it down. Generally, I'll go for about three sets of 10 reps, repetitions. Again, it's depending on if you want to go for endurance or strength training. With strength training, you want to go for about 8 to 10 reps, more endurance than 12 to 15 reps with the same type of sets. Up again and down. Now, assuming you want to work both your shoulder muscles and your trapezius muscles, then we just go mid-grip, somewhere in between narrow and wide. And then I'm engaging both muscles, my shoulders and my triceps. All right. Inhale coming up, slowly lower it down. And those are the muscles developed doing the upright row.